Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Confessions of a Dollar Tree Addict. I'm Marina and we are on our way to the College Point Dollar Tree. As we're here, we are at the Dollar Tree in College Point in Queens. Now, honestly, this Dollar Tree is a great Dollar Tree. You never know what you're gonna find. Oh my gosh, look at what I'm being greeted by. This is so funny. <laughs> Look at that. It's an army of gnomes waiting to greet us. Extra value every day, Dollar Tree. Yes. Let's get in there and see what we find, guys. Look at that fan. Whoa. It's super gorgeous. Really gorgeous. Oh, they all have butterflies. Okay, all of the new fans are all butterfly prints. This is fantastic. Yes, love it. I don't want to stretch them out because I'm not buying them, but they're so pretty. That is really cool. For the spring, people love butterflies. Maybe you could even use this fabric for something else. Okay, guys, the Easter decor is crazy. Look at this. First of all, happy Easter. This is new. I've never seen it before and it's so, so simple and nice. Welcome with the bunny. Love it. So many old favorites and new favorites, guys. Look at these. Happy Easter with the pink jacket or the blue jacket on the bicycle. Bunny riding the bike. Love it. Happy Easter with the gnome. Then we have Happy Easter with this pink gingham grow grain ribbon or blue. One for a girl, one for a boy adorable these actually have faux fur for the rabbit i mean you can't make this stuff up then these they've had them before are just stupendous and cotton tails pick your own carrot patch it looks like they opted to only make the black and white one which was probably the most popular because those three together they're super farmhouse but now they've given us some even cuter signs look at this the hunt is on this sign looks like it's three dollars it's only a dollar 25 that's what i like to see you are some bunny special again look at how thick it looks like it's a three dollar sign only a dollar 25 carrots for the easter bunny yes and again only a dollar 25 every bunny welcome Easter Bunny stop here. Love it. It's like super chocolatey. And then we have Hippity Hop. But then look at these. It's gorgeous. It says Carrot Patch Locally Grown. So nice. We've seen these tags before. But then look at this. Easter Egg Farms. Bunny Treats Sold Here. Beautiful. Then we have the Happy Easter and the Easter Bunny stop here in the yellow and the green. Those are super pretty too. We have this Happy Easter that looks like a chocolate bunny up there. And then we have Hippity Hoppity, super farmhousey cuteness. But then look at these, Happy Easter. This is like folk art almost. I love the way that this egg is designed. It's so cute. And then its counterpart up here, welcome friends, beautiful. Welcome to our carrot patch gorgeous. Welcome to Cottontail Farms. Adorable. Welcome to our patch with tinsel. Honestly, I don't like tinsel, but this I like. I really do. I really do. It's already in my cart. Look, it's in my cart. I really like it, guys. It It's adorable. Easter blessings, again, with that folk art looking beautiful floral print around them. And each rabbit is in a different pose. Do you guys see that? These are really, really cute. And then we have the garlands that we've had in the past. We've seen those before, but they're back again. And these felt bunny garland with the pom-pom butts, they're a good size. Then we have every bunny welcome with the dangly feet. You guys remember this one, those dangly feet. And then we have the Easter bunny gnomes that confuse me, but I do love the gnome Rietta because I love this color green. And then we've got this blue gingham. And then we've got this pink dude and the blue dude, but the gnome Rietta is the one that's in green, which is a little weird because I would have probably done that differently, but it's not up to me. And then they have all this cute garland and look at the multicolor garland, really cute. And of course, these absolutely fabulous 
$1.25 carats that Target also makes one similar, but these are beautiful. I love them super duper a lot. We have several styles. We've got the large orange and white, the small orange and white, checkered print and the polka dot so so cool and we also have the like orange burlap aren't those so so cool I just love them let me just take a step back and really give you guys a great look at what they're giving us these signs right here with the wooden beads and this additional garland they are absolutely amazing I am in love but the whole collection is really really amazing and then look at this egg shaped wreath i don't know but i'm kind of even liking this this is nice actually i could see people doing that up they've got a lot of tinsel pieces they don't usually speak to me oh look at this this bunny's doing tricks <laughs> i don't know i don't remember him from the past they're really cute usually i don't like them but i am buying this one i absolutely love it i don't know why but i just love this oh because it's orange that's why i love it i can't take dollar tree sometimes look at this for only a dollar 25 you could get unicorn waffles that are candy cane flavored artificially and naturally flavored it says or yellow cake and rainbow sprinkle flavored birthday cake waffles. I just got done learning how to make chaffles because I can no longer eat white flour. And here Dollar Tree is tempting me, of course, and as usual. But I'm definitely going to grab a box of each of these for my son and husband because that's a great deal. Six waffles for $1.25 cannot be beat. The giant bags of the limited edition makes 12 cookies pumpkin spice cookie mix 17 and a half ounce this is a huge bag are here in west islip and i know that people are going to be scooping these up because we don't usually get bags that big usually our packages of cookie mix are 6.5 ounce so you're getting tons of cookie mix for that buck and we point. have seen the reese's puffs bats before but they've got a ton of them at West Islip, so I thought I should mention, if you're on the hunt for some yummy peanut butter flavored cereal, peanut butter and chocolate that is, 11 and a half ounce box is nothing to sneeze at at a buck and a quarter. Oh, they are definitely bringing in lots of items for Easter basket stuffing. They've got this large freewheeling turbo wheels dirt bike, comes in the pink, it comes in the green, and it comes in this cool blue. Those are great for Easter basket stuffing, but I'm gonna pan over. They did bring in the squishy toys. We've seen these before. Kids love them. There's one that's shaped like poop. You guys have seen it. It's the poop shape. Kids honestly do love that stuff, especially those are good for boys. They have all the make it blocks that we saw during the holidays, but I'm seeing some really good stuff, guys. Yes, do you see this? How cool is this? Sally from Nightmare Before Christmas. I love that movie. We've got the Oogie Boogie. I love it. We've got Santa Jack, Jack Skeleton, and we have Zero. I mean, who doesn't love this movie? I'm thrilled to see these. And I'm happy to see these here, although I've not seen the Harry Potter ones yet. And I would really love to find those. I have seen the Ushis, the DC version, which is awesome and exciting. And I have seen the Ryan's World, but they've got them here at West Islip. We've seen the Raya, the last dragon. This is amazing, but they've got them here at West Islip. So they're going everywhere and I'm really psyched about that because I'm going to start collecting from all over to fill Easter baskets of the kids in the shelters that I like to supply during the holidays with Easter stuff for their Easter baskets. Now, among us, this one is a big, big hit. Kids love this and it's really, really cute what's inside. So that's what they have here at West Islip, but it seems like every store is getting a little something different and I'm still on the hunt for the Harry Potter ones. I love Harry Potter myself. Now these are actually labeled Happy Easter basket stuffers. So there's no if, ands, or buts about it. LA Color said, put these in Easter baskets. They come in coconut gelato. The packaging is super cute. And I think that they would be nice for kids. They would definitely enjoy it. 
Then we've got cotton candy with this pretty blue. We've got strawberry and mint. I love mint. Then we have creamsicle. It's a little discombobulated, but we'll muddle through. Vanilla. They also have orange. Orange looks very enticing, but lots of flavors. I'm seeing watermelon and I'm seeing chocolate. Which one's your favorite? My favorite is definitely almost always gonna be mint. Mint or coconut, but mint, even the color, it looks so, it almost looks like you can eat it like a real gelato. Oh my, here's another five pack of awesomeness in No Show's Illumination Minions, The Rise of Gru. These are absolutely fabulous. I love the Minions and I love the colors of these socks. Look at how cute. Are they not adorable? Oh my gosh. Kids are gonna love these. These are great for even Easter baskets. Who does not love themselves some Minions? I sure do. So for a buck and a quarter, five pairs is a steal. Look at this, guys. This is crazy. This is a real slinky. Are you seeing that? It is by slinky. It is the real deal. It's humongous for $1.25. I'm seeing it in hot pink, green, and blue. And that is an awesome, awesome stocking stuffer. Wow, I'm really impressed. Those are legit. They've got these splat balls that are poo. We've seen a lot of poo today, but you know, it's not really poo, you get it. They've got the kitty in a pocket and now they made a series two of the totally tinies. They're up way up high. I'm gonna have to bring them down. And they've got the Ooshies that we've seen before from DC Comics and Space Jam. We've seen those before and the Disney Dorables, which is series five. Those are amazing $1.25 pickups absolutely amazing but i'm seeing some more goodies okay so series two blind bags they are slightly different than the last ones because if you guys remember the other ones were like eggs and i don't remember but i remember eggs now we have a cute teapot and a little mug drive through service i see corn on the cob and a hot dog pretzel and I don't even know what that is. What is that? Are the Oh my gosh, those are gummy bears. How cute is that? So that's what you can get in your totally tiny blind bags series 2. Kids really like those. Those are cool. Then we have two stamps included in these Disney stampers. Now that is awesome. Oh my gosh, look a bumblebee. I would love to get the bumblebee. Oh, they have Minnie's bow. Those are actually really cute. I think kids will love those. They have Winnie the Pooh and the Honey Pot. Those are very, very adorable. Kids love stampers and they stamp themselves and everything around them and it's all fun and games. Now we have splat balls. I remember when these were crazy expensive for a buck and a quarter. This is awesome. Perfect, perfect Easter basket stuffer. And it's good for any gender, boys or girls. They have Spidey. I am seeing the Hulk, yes. This bright yellow Iron Man is awesome. I'm going to put them all back in once we see everything there is to be seen. Captain America. Looks like that is everything. I definitely think Spidey's gonna fly, fly out of here. Who is not gonna love the quintessential Spidey face? I'm kind of surprised I don't see the Black Panther but maybe I missed out on that one. Let me know if there are others that are out there that I have not yet seen, but I am really excited to see lots and lots of blind bags in the stores. I'm still on the hunt for Harry Potter. Ooh, they repackaged their faux Barbies in cute spring gear, but I'm liking the packaging. Actually, the boxes look better than the dolls do, but in a pinch for a buck and a quarter, those are cute. Ooh, I love this dress. It's super nice. And look at this. This is cute for a Valentine's Day gift with that beautiful heart clad dress. Really cute. What in the world is this? And it doesn't even have a tag on it. It's in the $1.25 section. It's huge, guys. This would be cool to make a candle out of. Um, I've never seen this before. Wish it had a lid. I don't know. I kind of like this. This is very cool. Where did, the, where did this come from? I am in love with the new color that they have introduced in their party section. This awesome green is beautiful. 
and this like salmony peach color. They have everything. If you look in several stores, you'll find all the pieces. I'm gonna insert a picture over here from a previous shop with me, but these colors are wonderful. They've had this and they do have a different green, but these new colors are great for the spring. Oh, I wanted to let you guys know that this unsweetened applesauce is so yummy. Definitely buy this for the kiddos. They're gonna love it. Put it in the freezer as kind of like a smoothie. It's really, really good. On earth is this. It says that it's by the brand Joie, Joy. But this is cool. Just in time for my new obsession that I've been making, chaffles. <laughs> this spatula flex flip turner for a buck and a quarter that's so cool you guys this is definitely from walmart originally and now it's here for a dollar 25. so the other day when i was having so much trouble with my phone and i shared a video and i said that i was wearing the clean beauty makeup i was wearing this as my blush and my lipstick and then later on in my haul i put the classic red on over that but I really like it. And I was also wearing this as my foundation. And you guys said that it looked really good. Well, those were the items that I had on. This foundation and as concealer, I was not wearing concealer. I wasn't completely satisfied that it had concealed, but this is foundation. So I just decided to see how good of a foundation it is. It's not bad, you guys. And I was using this and then later on, again, like I said, I put this on and I had the pictures in my video, but I don't know what happened. Somehow they disappeared. But for those of you who have been asking me, that's what I was wearing in my video. Okay, so here's the hilarious thing. I just ran in to West Babylon to get the boys some of these ice cream bars. They love them. And if you guys remember on my road trip last week, I found these but I never found the teaspoons. And I just found this pack right here of teaspoons over there on the floor, literally on the floor. And I picked it up and I was like, oh, this was meant for me. And then boom, I walk over here and they have the whole entire collection. They have the Tustin, T-U-S-T-I-N. They have everything. They've got the salad forks, the dinner forks, the teaspoons, and the tablespoons. They have everything for $1.25. Oh, wait, no, they don't. They don't have the knives. Oh my gosh, Dollar Tree, you make me crazy. So, what? Is that how they're doing this? They're sending everything but one item? So you have to go, cr What? what is going on? Is that how this has been going down? If you found these, did you find everything in one store? Did you have to go to several stores to find the entire and complete collection? Because that would drive me completely batty. But I'm going to, it was the teaspoons that I didn't have, right? I'm almost positive that's what I'm missing. I feel like I should get one of everything in case I'm wrong. And they've restocked the cutting boards and I'm going to grab some because I have a really cool idea for those. So I'm gonna grab a couple of those and take them home with me. Uh, I, I think I'm gonna grab one of everything because I honestly, I can't remember now. I'm almost positive. You guys are probably screaming at me right now, but they won't go to waste. I hope that they show up in more and more stores because I really would love to be able to buy these in bulk and donate them. And what's with this? I don't remember them having this knife. This looks like a good knife for a buck and a quarter. See, I'm telling you guys, they bought up all those awesome utensils and cutlery and then they knocked them off because they never had this paring knife. Comment down below if you've seen it before because I have the steak knives. I don't ever remember seeing this paring knife. And honestly, I love the little teal not this one this is like my absolute favorite knife to use in the house i love it i manage not to cut myself with it knock on wood and it works perfectly for me i love all the little silicone utensils i think that they are absolutely fantastic for a buck and a quarter i really enjoy them this one all of them but in teal and they're like fully stocked with those again but this Gibson stuff, oh, so good hey, for a buck friends, and a quarter. That's it for the walkthrough, but it's not 
it for the video because I have a pop-up subscriber appreciation gift for you guys. And in this subscriber appreciation gift are these two beautiful makeup bags that are gold and rose gold and gorgeous. All four of the beautiful St. Patty's Day gnomes. I love these gnomes. We have this Get Youthful Serum by Pro Effects. This Jean-Pierre Green Gel Mask that's cactus water infused. And we have this Vanilla Balsam Bath and Body Works candle. I love the packaging on this candle. And I feel like you guys will too. It is perfect for St. Patty's Day and beyond. I am including in this subscriber appreciation gift to welcome in, in the spring, the beautiful spring palette that I found that I am sharing with you guys. Now this is a unicorn, my friends. I didn't find a lot of these, but I am super happy to share one of these beautiful, as it says, spring of the Four Seasons eyeshadow palettes with you. Can you guys get into that palette? It is gorgeous. I love it, but... A blast from the past and one that I truly love as well is this hard candy infused with hemp oil eyeshadow palette that is also included in this St. Patty's Day subscriber appreciation gift. I'm also including this really pretty green gorgeous paparazzi necklace, this aloe gel eye mask from Timu that is absolutely wonderful. You're going to love it. Of course, no subscriber appreciation gift is complete from this Dollar Tree addict without a pair of fabulous shades, and this tortoiseshell pair is no exception. I hope that you guys enjoy these sunglasses as much as I do because I have the exact same pair. Now, I have included in this subscriber appreciation gift that I'm going to call Eat, Drink, and Be Merry because St. Patty's Day really is about eating, drinking, being Irish for the day, and being merry. So I've included this pot of gold cup and the beautiful green studded one that was so hard to find during the holiday season. Let me know in the comments down below if you were able to get one of these awesome Starbucks dupes because they were truly hard to find. I've also included in this giveaway this beautiful gold silky looking scrunchie that I found in the Dollar Tree because it is just so pretty and also welcoming the spring, I feel. And I've also included this beautiful six piece set of bobby pins by Scrunchy Elite as well. In this subscriber appreciation gift, we also have by C Color the matte liquid lipstick set in the nudes. I love, love these lipsticks, and I know you will too. Also, I have included this air spun loose face highlight that is. A really gold, beautiful highlight. You guys know how I feel about my highlight. And one of these must-have beauty powder brushes to go along with that. Also included in the subscriber appreciation gift is this really pretty little grow grain ribbon with shamrocks all over it. I've also included this beautiful gold crackle overcoat by Sally Hansen. This is a fabulous product that I personally love and have used and really enjoy. And I am including by Sally Hansen this Revive Peel Off Nail Mask. I absolutely love both of those $1.25 Dollar Tree finds. Matter of fact, I love all of my $1.25 Dollar Tree finds. And as of lately, the Hey Humans line is nothing to sneeze at. And I'm super excited to include these obviously green Banana aloe canisters of body lotion and body wash, naturally derived awesomeness, also included in the subscriber appreciation gift by Victoria's Secret, a fragrance that I actually really love called Exotic Woods. It has warm sandalwood, lush rose, twilight trance. And I figured that the St. Patty's Day Nomi would approve of that for sure. I've also included three of the colors of 
the plumping lip balms from L'Oreal that I absolutely love in these metallic cases. I figured they would be perfect for St. Patty's Day. And this e.l.f. shimmer highlight that I also really, really like. And of course, if you don't feel like doing anything for St. Patty's Day, you can still stay home, chillax, and use your de-puffing under eye micro darts by Freeman or your Real Veggie Farm double shot avocado mask or your St. Ives Glowing Sheet Mask in Apricot. This is a really nice mask. I love those. I wish I could have found more. But this, this Mask Bar Brightening Biocellulose Mask is wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. For a buck and a quarter, I loved that buy. And I've also included this Uzu Face Gold Foil Layer Mask Gold Moist Repair. This is an awesome mask as well. This was actually gifted to me and I kept one for St. Patty's Day because it's gold, of course. But like I said, you guys, the name of this subscriber appreciation gift is Eat, Drink, and Be Merry. So I've also included this Salt Fat Acid Heat Notebook Set. It's an absolutely awesome type of a food journal set. You guys remember this from a while ago. It has like a file folder for you to keep recipes and receipts. And it has these four awesome notepads for you to keep track of what you're eating or what you want to buy. It's absolutely fabulous. And I thought you guys would love it. And it even comes with this case. Last, but certainly not least, since this is going to be an eat, drink, and be merry subscriber appreciation gift, I have decided to give you guys all of the components that I have found so far of this Tussin Utensils Gibson collection. Turns out I did have the teaspoons and the knives and the forks, but I don't have the salad fork. So if that's okay with you, it's okay with me because I'm also giving you guys these items in the subscriber appreciation gift. All of this can be yours if you are subscribed to the channel, are 18 years of age, are living in the United States of America, and understand that I bought these items. I'm popping this giveaway up in this video just to help support my community. My awesome subscribers deserve a giveaway every once in a while. And if you share this video, you will receive five additional entries into this pop-up giveaway. If you are a member of my channel, you automatically get the five extra entries. And if you share it, I will find a way to give you 10. So, so my friends, the last thing that I have left to give you is the hashtag for this subscriber appreciation gift. And the hashtag for this subscriber appreciation gift is hashtag eat, drink, and be merry. I hope you guys are excited to potentially win all of these awesome Dollar Tree unicorns. And if you are, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, share my video with your friends, and of course, I wish you guys the luck of the Irish Nomies. Good luck, my friends. Stay safe and stay savvy. Bye-bye. That's it, guys. Have you guys found anything amazing lately? Leave a comment down below. And don't forget to like this video. And please make sure to share it with your friends and subscribe. Stay safe and stay savvy, guys. Bye-bye.